I know you're here because something has changed. A loss that's left you feeling shattered, raw, maybe even questioning anything and everything. It might feel like the world has shifted beneath your feet, like a part of you is missing. I get it. And right now you may be wondering how you'll ever find your way through, but you don't have to do it alone. Today, let's spend a few minutes together, grounding ourselves in small but powerful reminders of hope, resilience, and purpose. You're stronger than you know, even if it doesn't feel that way right now. So take a deep breath. Settle in. And let's begin the journey back to you. First, I want to say, whatever you're feeling right now is valid. There is no right or wrong way to process a loss. Whether it was sudden, expected, or something you tried to prepare for, it's still a wound that needs healing. You might feel anger, sadness, frustration, or even numbness. And all of that is okay. Loss does not come with a rule book. You don't have to feel any way other than how you feel right now. Loss leaves us feeling raw, as though part of us have been chipped away. And when we feel that, it's easy to forget just how powerful we are. We forget that we're still here, still breathing, and still capable of healing. So today, I'm here to remind you that you're not alone. We're going to explore some of the ways to reclaim a bit of hope. And remember that there is light, even in the darkest of places. Let's start with something simple, but incredibly powerful. This moment. Right now, you're here. And that's already a huge step. When we go through a loss, it's easy to get tangled up in memories or the what ifs. It's easy to feel overwhelmed by the future, wondering if this pain will ever end, if you'll ever feel whole again. But the thing is, healing doesn't happen all at once. It happens moment by moment. And if you can, just for this moment, focus on the breath coming in and out of your body. Notice the ground beneath you, the air around you, and the steady rhythm of your heartbeat. This moment is a reminder that you're still here, still moving forward, even if it doesn't feel like it. Every breath is an act of resilience, and with each one, you're taking a small step towards healing. Sometimes the bravest thing you can do is just keep breathing. I want to remind you of something important. You have been through difficult things before. You face challenges, 
felt heartache and experienced disappointment. And yet, you're still here. Every scar tells a story of strength, even if you can't see it. Think back to another time when life knocked you down. Maybe it was in a different way. Maybe the circumstances were different. But think about the strength it took to get back up. You have the same strength within you now, even if it feels far away. Life has a way of revealing your resilience when we least expect it. In moments like these, it's okay to give yourself credit for simply surviving. Don't rush yourself to be okay and over it. Healing isn't a race, it's a journey. Let yourself move forward at your pace. Loss can often leave us feeling lost, as though the ground has shifted beneath our feet. It can make us question our purpose, our worth, and what we're here to do. But sometimes, loss opens a doorway to discovering something new about ourselves. This pain, as hard as it is, might be guiding you towards a new purpose or calling. Maybe this is a time to rediscover things that bring you joy. Perhaps there's something you've been wanting to explore, something that sparks your curiosity or soothes your soul. Small passions and joys can act as little stepping stones towards wholeness. Take things one step at a time. And if you're not sure where to start, that's okay too. Sometimes just giving yourself permission to try something new, even something as simple as reading a new book, painting, or going for a walk can open a door to healing. It's easy to be hard on yourself during times like these you might feel that you should be feeling better or that you're not coping the way others might expect. But here's the thing. There is no right way to grieve, heal, or move forward. Every person's journey is unique. Allow yourself to be imperfect. Let yourself feel however you feel without judgment. There's a powerful kind of beauty and vulnerability in allowing yourself to be human, to feel, and to heal in your own time. Letting go of perfection can be liberating. It's an act of self-love. Take time to treat yourself gently as you would a close friend who's hurting Be kind to yourself and give yourself space to heal. Healing isn't linear, and that's perfectly okay. Sometimes, one of the hardest, most necessary steps in healing is allowing others to support us. You don't have to carry this burden alone. It's okay to reach out to someone you trust and let them in. Opening up to someone can be like opening a window to let fresh air in. It brings light to the parts of us that have been kept in the dark. Whether it's a friend, a family member, a counselor, or a support group, don't be afraid to lean on others. People around you care more than you know, and they want to be there for you. Reaching out does not make you weak. It makes you courageous. It's a reminder that we're all connected and that sometimes healing can come from allowing someone else to share our journey with us. Lastly, 
I want you to know that hope is always possible. Right now, it might seem faint, and it might feel like a distant light. But hope has a way of finding us when we least expect it. Remember that this pain, as intense as it feels, is temporary. There will be moments of joy again, and you will find yourself laughing, smiling, and feeling peace once more. Loss doesn't have to define us. It can simply become part of the journey we've traveled, adding depth and strength to who we are. Hold on to hope, even if it's just a small glimmer. The beauty of life is that it's constantly changing, and with each day, new possibilities are waiting to be discovered. Thank you for spending this time with me today. My hope is that something here has sparked a bit of comfort, encouragement, or even just a moment of peace. Remember, you are stronger than you know, braver than you feel, and loved more than you realize. Take each day as it comes. Be gentle with yourself. Allow yourself to feel and trust that little by little, you'll find your way forward. No matter where you are in this journey, remember that this is not the end. There's so much left to explore, to experience, and to love. Take care, keep breathing, and don't give up. You've got this.